Hello everyone, welcome back to uh, Search Creator YouTube channel. Uh, the question paper, model question paper series of uh, this video. Okay, the course code is BCS602 and the course name is Machine Learning. Okay, in the previous video, we will discuss a 6A question. So 6A question is a ID3 problem algorithm using problem solving. So 6B question is analyze decision tree learning with its structure, adver uh, advantages and disadvantages. So you need to answer um, these three uh, aspects firstly you need to write the what is their diagram is there so this is textbook diagram so firstly what is the root node and in decision what are the components occurring so you need to write that one so the components are root node and decision node and leaf node in the textbook is given wrong uh, text this is the this is the root node right correct this is the root node is circle and uh, this is the uh, diamond shape and rectangle shape. This like this. You need to write the like this. And the next, the next is what is decision tree definition. You need to write the decision tree uh, introduction means definition. Decision tree is a supervised predictive model used for classification task. You need to write this point. These three points. Firstly, definition of these only point wise. These three points you need to write. You need to write read this also. And the next model description description of the what is the decision tree model. Where it is used, you need to write three again three points. These three points and structure of the decision tree. What is the root node and decision node, branches, leaf node, and fifth point. So, what are the conjunction test and disconjunction rules? Everything you need to write the structure of the decision tree. Five point six points you need to write these six point and what are the procedures involved in building the decision tree? So, uh, what are the aspect? Uh, uh, building the decision tree you need to write these two five points both five points like this and after that the aspect advantage and disadvantage both two uh, aspects one is advantage and second one is disadvantage what are the advantages there now you need to write like this this point wise so it is easily understanding and visually read, uh, readable this format you need to download our notes it is easy easy to for exams and the disadvantage you need to write the any Three or four, not uh, this much. You need to write any three or four. That uh, that is a enough. So you need to write the uh, for this question. It is allocated ten marks. So a uh, diagram they given the two marks, and after that description, introduction, description, and structure and procedure. What are in involved and advantages and disadvantages. So everything you need to should write the in the exam hall. Okay. I hope you understanding this uh, question. Because of I am not explaining in depth because it exam time now so that reason I am not explaining in depth so I will tell you how much you need to write and just one um, one time you read this everything one time you read this is enough not read uh, by art the these uh, types of answers you not need not to uh, buy out these answers just one time read and memorize the concept and understand the concept that is enough. Okay, so you need to practice this diagram because every uh, answers to every questions you need to write the diagrammatic. Then only it is a heading highlight the answers and they you give the marks very easily. Okay, so this is my suggestion. Thank you for watching this video and if you any suggestion or any comments, please comment below. We will help you. Thank you for watching this video.